Professor Rich Aran here with you today. Today I'm going to show you how I got this UA or urinary analysis from a Foley catheter for my patient Michelle right here. All right, so if your physician has ordered you to get a UA sample from your patient who has a Foley catheter already in place, we cannot take it directly from that bag if it's been inserted already. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the port that's provided on the Foley catheter kit. So as you can see, this is a port and this port actually is a lure lock, meaning that you can take a syringe and you can screw it onto it and it's going to uh, allow you to withdraw. Before you withdraw any urine to collect the UA, you need to clamp the tubing. So this particular Foley catheter, as you can see, has a green clamp. So you're gonna have your gloves on, you performed hand hygiene, you're gonna take that clamp and you're gonna bend the tubing like so, and you're going to just do this clamp right over the top, and then the urine is gonna collect right in there. As you can see, it's been about 15 minutes and we have urine that has collected um, right here in between where I clamped that tubing and the port for its draining. So now it's starting to back up, so now it's gonna be a great time for me to go ahead and withdraw that urine. So I have now determined that enough urine has collected in the tubing. So I've gone ahead and got my red biohazard lab bag as long as well as a collection container for urinary sample. And it's labeled with my patient's sticker or their name, date of birth, whatever uh, policy that you have at your hospital to keep that stuff identified. So I have that right with me. All right, so your first step before you withdraw the urine is take an alcohol pad and you're going to clean this per your policy of your facility, whether it's for 30 seconds or three wipes. It just depends on your facility. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this for 30 seconds. Let it dry briefly. Then you're gonna take your clean 10 um, sterile syringe that you have right here. And you're gonna go ahead and screw that in because it's a lure lock right on there. And then now I'm going to go ahead and withdraw. Okay, now I've gotten more than 10, 10 cc's of urine. So now I can go ahead and come over to my so now you just take your 10 cc syringe that we have and then you're just gonna go ahead and go ahead and shoot it in your collection chamber. You're gonna dispose of your syringe. You're gonna go ahead and cap it. 